And Grim Gates, let's go. Venno joining and throwing his hat in the ring. I don't think Venno can get a 30 bomb. I mean, it don't matter. And he might even get a 40 bomb. Who knows, actually? I don't know. We'll see. A few moments later. Oh, he knows the POI well, though. Oh, I never knew about farming down here. Ooh. I'm not playing this year, bro. Oh, my God! Oh, Mario's about to get his second. Wait, second Elim, bro. Mario's already got one Elim. Wait, is he cheating? What the fuck? Oh no! Hey, oh no! Resetting? The EU forty bomb not off to a good start. Oh, oh, never mind. Mario's the goat. Mario survives when all would perish. W, the dream is alive. Let's see how Swizzy's game starts. He's gonna land on top of the chest for the auto pickup. Yoink! <laughs> I love it. Everyone just scurries, bro. It's so funny. They're all waiting. <laughs> they all start running. <laughs> There's like a full. It's like a rat. <laughs> just starts scurrying away. Meanwhile, oh my god, it's Batman. I didn't know Batman was on the prediction. The hero Fortnite needs right now, but doesn't deserve. Oh, pink in an awkward spot now. He's pinned between the two players. Batman type shit. Batman type shit. <laughs> Batman type shit. Oh, I love pink. Oh, meanwhile, we're, che we're checking in with Robin. We got Vico on one Elim. He's got EMPs. Interesting. That is actually an item that Robin would use. Yeah, well, that's a Robin play right there. My man's also Batman's duo. It's perfect. That was the most Robin play I've ever seen. Nice. Let's go. All right. Robin on double Elims. Swizzy on three kills. Swizzy looking good. Wonder who's gonna get uh who's gonna get the medallion first. Oh, we only we have a drum gun in oh drum gun DMR, nice, that's four. If you guys missed it, Swizzy dropped a 37 kill win last week on EU, so potentially the contender to take the 40 bomb from Marius. We'll see. Oh, nice. Oh, he knows someone's nearby. He's gotta be careful, they're jumping. Oh, he's not I'd rush the boss here, honestly. I would try and take down Cerberus as quick as possible here. Oh, it's game two for the deal. Okay. My bad. I'll take him off. No. My man elevates up a box and there's randomly Big Bobby AI. Why is, why is Big Bobby AI just in that box as well? That is so disastrously unfortunate. Wow. Ooh. 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 Oh, no. Not looking good for Swizzy. We could still win this. We just don't have a lot of meds. We got two. We got two flow berries. So we're gonna have to play this extremely well to win this. Nice, 97. There you go. That evens the playing field. We're about equal health now, and the third party's here. Oh, shield bubble, Junior. Nice, disengage. We only have two builds left. We have got to be careful here. Oh, it's not looking good. Oh God, we glitched. Oh God. This couldn't be going much worse, I'm not going to lie. What is this? Why can't I even get dash here, man? You can see in what I'm stuck, man. What the hell am I stuck here? Why can't I even get dash here, man? You can see? What is this, man? This is a crazy thing, man. I agree. Oh, Marius is looking good right now. Marius got the good pacing. Marius is looking good right now. Marius got the good pacing. If this is a decent lobby that stays stacked, he's in a really good spot. This is going to depend all on the lobby now. Marius has got everything he needs to close it out. And he did it in pretty good pacing. 59 alive with 7 elims is good. Very good, actually. Not if he versus too many players like this, though. Ooh. Nice. Oh, it was Nebs. No way. No way Marius is going to drop a 40 bomb in a lobby that had Nebs in it. Surely not. Yeah. I don't know, man. Cash fights were just better. I'm going to say it. The weapon bunk is cool, but cash fighting was just so much better. It was more in the open. It was more exciting. It was more engaging. Weapon bunker fighting is just mad boring. They tried something new. I can respect it, but I, I'm not a fan. And they spawn so late. Half of them are in zone, so it's just like trading white health for like weapon. It's just I don't know. I don't, I don't like I don't like weapon bunkers. I thought caches were much better. I can see why they thought they might be good. It's just hasn't turned out to be that way. The lobby's staying nice and stacked, which is good too. 
Only 49 up. At this point in the game on EU, that's actually not that bad. It's not great, but it's not... I think this is definitely 40 bombable. It's not 50 bombable, though. I know where it's crazy. We're already talking about that, but... Marius had a game last week that was a possible 50 bomb. If he didn't die. Ooh, nice. Oh, my God. He took down the Skibbity Gyat 69. This generation's fucking doomed. Man, Toos is still fighting over this weapon bunker, as I was saying. Definitely one of the more boring additions to competitive, unfortunately. Unfortunately, the 50 bomb's looking very rough here, but hopefully Marius can turn into a 40 bomb. The problem is, if this turns into like a high 20 or even like a, like a mid 30, that's his one chance. I wonder if it's honestly worth Marius if he gets close to winning this game, deliberately coming second. So he gets another chance at the 40 bomb in another low skill based matchmaking lobby. The content is 1,000% worth more than $76. This man has 6k viewers now? Bro, Marius on that big blow up and I'm so happy for him. That's sick. That's awesome. Dude was averaging like 300 viewers a month ago. Not even kidding. That is a big old blow up, especially without going like the full TikTok route either. Homie's name is DMA Aim 77 He's got zero kills. I'm actually happy that happened. I'm happy that happened. I'm not even kidding. I'm genu I think that is honestly better for Marius to die there. I think that was looking almost impossible for the 40 bomb. He would have just got like a 20 to 30 bomb, which is still good. But then it would have ruined his chance of getting a 40 bomb today. Because there's no chance you can get it in a lobby after winning. So honestly, I'm genuinely kind of happy Marius died there for his sake as well. This, yeah, Cammy just de destroyed this dude's builds. Just ate through his build. All right, 41 alive for Nako. Oh, Vico does have the dash medallion. But then again, in this zone, the dash medallion is not going to be as strong. It's just finishing right on River Sticks. Oh, nice refresh. Really nice refresh. Wow. 504. Gigantic refresh. Trying to get the extra brick. Only five brick. Medkid's in there as well. Vico just got a big blessing. As Leo gets nice. another Elim. Three Elims for Leo. 50 alive. Gotta be careful of the lobby focus right now. We're in a rough position. Back against the wall. We need to be careful here. Very careful. Vico almost double digits here. It's not like a 30 or 40 bomb or anything. He's playing very well. Wins a win. $76 either way. Nice. Two still looking strong too. Most of our POVs are looking good here. Looking very good here. Ça passe tous les jours. MXR running Ça the sniper auto shotgun loadout. Very brave. The money maker loadout. Ugh, it's not looking good for running the sniper right now. Oh boy. This should have been a firing range. It was a firing range. We just didn't hit any of the targets. Oh, MXR. I know you're better than this. Oh. Oh, no. Come on, MXR. We got to hit one of these, bro. He's taking the shots. I'll give him that. My man's trying. He's not giving up. Oh, Vico on the high ground with the dash medallion. Nako in the mid ground. MXR gets a kill on the drop down. Kami gets a refresh. Kami gets a big refresh. Needs to be careful. He doesn't want to take too much zone. That's three med kits now. Nice upgrade for Kami. Kami does have double mythic as well. Wait a second. Kami. This could be a win right here. Three med kits, four splashes, double mythic. Only 24 alive. Kami looking fantastic. And Maxar struggling after not getting a refresh on the sniper. He's got a banana going though. Vico still going strong as well. Nice. Good high ground for Vico. Vico could be winning this. We got, we're going to see a few wins here, I think. We, had a, we, we were off with our first few perspectives, but I think right now we're looking at some wins. Still got the sniper in hand of Leo as well here. Leo needs to get some more white, hand, white heals. He's only got two bananas and one flopper. That's not going to win a game on EU. Meanwhile, Toos only has two bananas. We're not seeing a lot of meds across the board right now. This heal off is going to be the, the deciding factor for so many of these players right now. It's the one thing they're all missing. Good builds by Toos. Takes the high ground, gets front side, puts the pressure on him, plays in zone. Trying to get him killed here. He needs those extra meds. He gets the cone. Beautiful cone. Can't take the wall. Damage around the corner. And he goes down. Nice. Refresh. But only gains an extra banana. Toos. 
Struggling for the heal off as well. Nako in the box. Needs to hit land this shot. Oh, no, oh, no. no, he's getting held in zone. Nako's trying to rotate around the outside. There goes his last white heals as well. Meanwhile, Chap's got a bunch of splashes. Kami's definitely our best looking player right now for this win. He's got all types of white heals. Nice. 13 alive. Five kills for Kami. Looking great. Leo's made his way to front side low ground. Four, four bananas though. Again, that's just really not a lot for the heal off at all. Can't even out heal a 10 tick with a banana. Poos with six elims, 11 alive, and he goes down. Poos falls. Vico on the high ground. Still looking like one of our best chances to win this, but eight alive. Three med kits, one splash. Could easily have someone in here with more meds than that. Top 10 for Nako. Six med kits for the Spaniard. Looking good. Kami, I think, spots more med kits, unless I'm mistaken. I swear there's more med kits in front of him. Must not be, otherwise Kami would be looking at him. Might not even need them though. Only seven alive. Not a, not a big heal off on EU today. A lot of these EU games actually die now pretty early. We might finally watch some not eight minute heal offs. Nice. Players a weak below Kami too. This could be a free win unless high ground is super stacked. Talking about super stacked high grounds. Vico doing his best to win this one without a heal off either. Only two players have to go down. Unfortunately, all it takes is one to beat you on the heal off though. Chap on the low grounds. Nako goes down without the win. Nako doesn't win it. Are we going to at least watch a single win here? Vico gets in and no, the max pump, 7 HP. No. Wow, I'm killing myself. In game. He was about to say in game, but I cut him off. Oh my God. No way Vico just lost that. Dash in the back of the box, 7 HP, and the kid hits the biggest max bailout ever. Jeez. All right, Cami in the five-way heal off. Can he win it? So far, everyone else has gone down. Cami will be the only win we've watched here. Out of all of these POVs, it is not easy to win this $100. Nice. Wrapping around the corner. Kami finds more bandages. Not that they're going to matter. This one's going to come right down to Storm Sickness. And oh, the Siphon. Siphon topping Kami up there. Dying in zone. Very, very big kill there for Kami. All right. We've only got time to pop one more med kit. It's going to be all about the floppers for the Storm Sickness. Surely this is enough from Kami. Six med kits and floppers. How is this game so stacked? All right, time to eat the floppies. Out heal the storm sickness. No. Uh, there was only five players went to that heal off for Kami. And with six med kits and three floppers, he couldn't even get a second. Also legit, das ist die what? Runde, die ich je gesehen hab, chat. Okay, well, it looked like <laughs> a lot of these so EU games weren't going to go to crazy heal off, but wow. Okay. Huh. And he had the siphon as well. He must have tanked some storm early. He has to have. He must have tanked some storm before we were watching. All right, does Chap win it? Can Chap get the win? Only seven alive, 16 kills. Looking like a potential little 20 bomb here for Chap. Nothing to scoff at. Six med kits, full Fizzberry jar, double gold weapons. Doesn't have the dashes though. He does have Zeus medallion from what I can tell. He does have Zeus medallion, but no dash. Very rare we see people win here with, the da with no dash. But then again, can easily still play this heal off. He's investing one med kit early here for only 20 HP. Interesting. That makes me think that he knows he's tanked enough storm tickets where he can't get six med kits off. Otherwise, that was a very questionable play. Oh, bananas in the box and no, he gets no, dropped in on the mehr. wood cone. Hey, what is this? What is this? I had the unstacked this round. Gets dropped down on the cone, unfortunately, when he goes for the refresh. Oh, wow. We've lost a lot of our POVs. Oh, someone just won. Venno just won. Venno wins his second game after struggling with the first one. He did. Love how my man's just got like a looping video of just a fireplace in the background. But it just makes him look like his room's on fire. Zone pulling up this big mountain is going to be huge if Kaizen gets up. If he makes... Oh, he does. Big for Kaizen. This lobby's about to die out very quickly. Especially if zone goes south, north, or east. If it goes anywhere but west, Kaizen's in for a treat. This lobby's going to die very quick. Oh, Zobby go, Z Z Lobby goes back west. I was going to say Zone and Lobby at the same time. Zobby. Zobby goes west. Lobby is saved right now. 19 alive. Good rotates by Kaiser, though. Nice and simple, but he's still going to need some more wide heals, I think. We are going back in towards Grand Glacier. That could keep the game more stacked. Let's people farm into the building and just hide. 
Nice. Right, staying elevated a bit. Looks like he's getting ready to go inside the glacier. There's the Fizzberry for the rotates. Nice. Good front side. Could be careful, though. This layer is very congested. Needs to find that refresh. He needs a big refresh very soon. Oh, play against the refresh, but at what cost? 18 HP, three med kits. Unfortunately, he didn't even gain much off that kill. He loses a med kit and only gains very little material. No builds. Comes down to this. Oh, we're playing the 50 second early heal off. Bold strategy by Kaizen here. Not one that I endorse. But we'll see how it plays out. Maybe with the mountain zone. Maybe this lobby somehow full dies in the mountain zone. Wait a second. Floppers. Wait a second. Top three. Kaizen might know something. I know. Please grab the dash battalion. Grab the dash battalion. No, he can't get up now. Never mind. It's over. It's over. Nah. Nah, grab the dash battalion, bro. Oh, he could have been storing up dashes right now to get in. Maybe this last guy shambles. Maybe it's doable. Maybe. Maybe. No, Maybe. I, I don't think he wins this, but... I think he needed to grab the dash medallion and start storing up the dashes while he was healing. Oh, we already got Storm Team this morning. We've got to pray this guy has literally zero meds. A single med kit and this other guy wins. Yeah. All right, 19 alive, 9 healers for Rezon. Oh, we're sipping the air out of the water bottle. Marius has died his first two games now, Mero, unfortunately. Game one just got over aggro on a kid, but honestly, the lobby was pretty dead. I don't think the 40 bomb was even likely at all. Um, second game, apparently, chat saying some suspicious play was in action. Someone targeting Marius a little bit deliberately, apparently. Which wouldn't surprise me. Marius has just had that big blob. Now he's going to start dealing with all the stream snipers. Kids throwing away literal money. Like, throwing away a chance at, like, actual money to try and ruin the game of someone who doesn't know them is just the most insane thing to me. Iron Refresh. Iron Refresh, man. Einfach nur Iron Refresh, bitte. Iron Lade in die Arme läuft, so wie der hier. Ungefähr. Den hole ich mir. This is a pretty dead game for Rezon, though. This should be very winnable. Just needs one refresh. This could be the big refresh he needs. Can't quite get the angle. The player strafes hard right. Ooh, almost makes it up to the high ground. Honestly, feel like staying low is a bit better right now. Oh my god. Big beams. Jeez, big beams from Rezon. Needs to just bleed one bullet through for the refresh. Can't seem to quite connect it. Man went for the pickaxe. Okay. Where's the bananas? Nice. Very nice. Six splashes, one make it, two bananas. Only six players alive. This is looking good for a Rezon win. Rezon is just printing money right now. My man is winning in every aspect. Ooh, I think it's a 23 tag, but I like the movement. Go on, elevating back up to second height. He really wants to make a play for this high ground. He's got the loot he thinks he needs to win. So, ooh, never mind. Now he's got the loot to win, for sure. We have secured the winning loot. Now I need to take high ground. Oh, the player's on top of him. No builds. He's got zero builds. Re oh, very little builds. Never mind. He has enough to try to fight for it, but Rezon takes it. Gets the chops. No, not reloaded. Not oh reloaded. God, get in, get in, get in, get in. Oh my god, Rezon almost tosses. Can't pretend I haven't done the same thing this season. Getting used to a shotgun with only three shots is so difficult. Okay. All right, top four. Three med kits, four splashes. Bro, Rezon's chat is... <laughs> look at Rezon's chat is spamming. I do like the Corgi emote. I do like the Corgi emote. All right, chat. As usual with Rezon, what are we thinking? 1v1 map, creator code, masterclass, YouTube, all of the above? I don't speak some zone, I give in. Oh, top three. Oh, he might be getting none of it. Never mind. He might be getting the vastest das. And my med kits. Oh, top three. Three med kits, 1v1. Med kits. Is three med kits enough to do it? Is three med kits enough to do it? There's extra mats down there, but he doesn't really need the builds right now. This is going to come down to a fight. All the med kits enough. Rezon risking it. Rezon standing on the walls. Man, such a cat and mouse game. He doesn't know. He doesn't trust it. Gets in. He's trying to bait the enemy. He can't bait it. The dash. Oh, oh my god, god that's god. insane. So good. Mom's life, that's so good. That was so well played. Guy, the Wendy fucking 100 dollars. Die nehme ich mir mit. Drittes Game is okay. Wisst ihr, ich brauch nur ein Game. It's okay. It's okay. We didn't get any of the plugs straight away. Well played, though. Well played. 
That's the kind of play where if you mess it up, everyone's going to flame you, but good decision making. That dash was clean. The dash that dodged the 50-50 on the edit was really nice. I wasn't expecting that. Good play, good play. Oh, we're in. Oh, Haim was looking real shaky, though. Hey. Proszę to udział! Ja mam demony w lobie. Ja mam demony w lobie, ja mam demony w lobie. I thought he yelled so loud he broke his camera just then. Am I the only one who thought that? I thought he yelled so loud his camera turned off. Because the screen went blank. This is definitely Kylie. <laughs> this skin could never be mistaken. Okay, jetzt hier schon eine Banane zu... Pommes. Oh my oh, god, 1v1. Oh my god, go Kylie, win a son, win a son. Three make hits, four floppers, four bananas. Kylie's really going to come back to competing and win it all. And by all, I mean 100 beans in the EU solo victory cup finals. He's too good. Oh my god, extra splashes. He just wins. There's just no way he wins. There's no way he loses this. Oh my god, there's just no way he loses this. He just wins. Like he's played the perfect game. Bro, unless he like, unless he's tanked 8,000 storm damage before we tune in, he just like has to win this. Come on, Kylie. Oh, oh, that could come. Oh, he wins. He wins. Free cash. <laughs> Free cash. <laughs> w. Nice, good layer swap. Needs to either drop one or down. Yeah, there we go. Drop one or go up one. Come on, Cubix, let's get it, son. 17 alive, one elim. Come on. We can win this. It's very winnable. We got the Fizzberry for some extra rotates here. Gold auto shotgun, I like it. Cubix has always been an auto shotgun main. Nice, good rotate. Sitting a little bit low. If it pulls max, I want to see him kind of elevate a little bit more in the next rotate. We'll see though. Yeah, I can stagger here and then elevate would be the play. We'll see. I think he's going to try. Nice, yo. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Oh, never mind. Play it deep in zone. Unfortunate. Went out the congested side. That's right, we got we to make it here. We're going to have to get a refresh here to win the game now, though. One make hit, two splash. Not going to do it. We're not even get the full make hit off. Oh, no, Cubix. What do we got? Come on, son. Let's see it. Nice. Good tarps. Good rotates. There's the refresh. There it is. The player's very weak, though. Oh, did he get that wall? Did he get that wall? Oh, I thought he took the wall behind him then. Mythic Gatekeeper, straight out of the sky. Unlucky. All right, let's see if Clement can do it. 30 alive, damn, stacker of a lobby for Clement. Probably because it's closed out here on the water, so everyone's getting max dashes. Ozzy, I called in 11,498th place and just won the game in finals. No shot. Classy, can you post your Fortnite tracker in chat? I want to see that, bro. If that is true, I'll genuinely make a tweet about it because that's like the never give up mentality right there. That's also why this format is so good, bro. Like, literally anyone has a chance to win. It's just so good for promoting, like, casuals to grind the game and take comp seriously. All right, top 26. So many players staying alive just because the max dash rotates. Oh, in a rough spot. We're backed up with all the metal. We're going to have to pop our meds and rotate around. Things not looking too great here for Clement. Nice. Decent layer here. He's trying to conserve what little mats he has left, though. We need a refresh really bad here. This is a good spot to find it. Beautiful. Beautiful awareness by Clement there. Great positioning. Really good game knowledge. All right. 12 alive. Three elims. That refresh is keeping us topped up for quite a while now. Ooh, can't seem to get a big pump shot to get that refresh. Ooh, Clement's taking this real safe. He's not taking any aggressive peaks, which I do like, but it means he's going to have to find another really good refresh. Top six. Zone's pulling back down into the dash water. He's going to make a very interesting heal off here with everyone having dashes. Oh, Clement dashes in a zone, though, as I say that. No, he's taking so much damage. The water movement. 
Not too hot for Clement right now. It's messing him up. He drops back behind the cone. Plays the banana early. Gets the Elim. Nice. That's extra make hits. We're going to have to play this heal off early and just pray. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. It's over. It's over. It's over. We had to drink. We had to eat the banana. And he's 3 HP. No. Ah, possible, bro. Ah, such an awkward end game. Top 10, 70 lives for Cammy. Four flops, three make hits. Looking good. Cammy's always good for at least one win on the day. Lobby's closed in six minutes, so I think this might be his last game. Good damage. Nice. Good refresh for... Ooh, 500 brick. Great refresh for Cammy. Ooh, dashed out of the box. Slippery superhero. Ja pierdolę, no nie mogę sobie cofać, no. No look like the Kami I know, but that's fine. Top three. We can still win this even with some choked edits. One minute and four seconds, top three. Might not even go to heal off. Kami might have to get active here. He's got the loadout for it. Purple burst, mythic shotgun. My man's got the fighting loadout left. Oh, this player is very elevated up above. Kami might be comfortable letting that player on high ground just top, and he'll just top and win the heal off. He might be fine not pressuring this guy above him. We'll see. He is elevating up, though, to make sure he stays above Mount Olympus. Doesn't take any damage. He doesn't need to. Ooh, he's having to fight the play on low ground. He's getting pinched. Only two opponents. He's getting pinched between both of them. Unfortunate position for Kami, but a nice topping gets him out of there. He's had to use a lot of builds to make it up Mount Olympus here. This has been rough. He's only got to survive for another 15 seconds, though, and then he's got all the heals to pop. I feel this guy on low ground is somehow going to ruin this. I just have a feeling. Oh, the guy on low ground, as I say that, I think he's already gone back to play the early heal off. Cammy going to try and go back and look for more meds. Oh, he marked more meds. Nice, Cammy. Nice, Cammy. There we go. More med kits. He's just too good, man. He's just too good. He's just robotic in the way he plays. It's just so, like, cool, calm, collected. Seriously. My man's just rotated back to three floppers and three make kids. He just wins. He should have had two wins as well. His game earlier today, he no, got so no, unlucky. No, I can't I have flopper. I took it, maybe, two ticks. And he just got the siphon as well, I think. Did he? He took ticks, but surely the guy above him took ticks as well. If, if he doesn't win this, I swear to God. He could have played this slightly better. And tanked a little bit less. But, like, seriously, if he loses two games like this today, I'm going to be pissed for him. He's played two games nearly perfectly. Almost any other lobby and he'd have a win. Oh, come on. There's no way he doesn't win this. Oh. I was actually going to freak out for him. I'm not going to lie. If he met, like, I know he didn't play it absolutely flawlessly, but he definitely played both those games well enough for easy wins. Very rare do you not win with how he played. He would have got so unlucky. Oh. Come on, Toos. We gotta win it. Nice. Oh, good angle by this guy behind the cone. That was holding that cone peak really well. Fifteen Elims. Good game from Toos. Oh, he keeps doing the dash pump and just missing it. There we go. 87 and 37. Nice shots. 17 kills. Just might money. not even go to heal off. He's only got three bananas. Kind of hopes it doesn't go to heal off. Oh. Nice. Top three. More med kits and splashes. He picked up five splashes. He's, he's just got to get back to those med kits. Oh, he's popping the splashes for shield. I don't know about this. Oh, I don't know about this. This is risky. Nice. Nice. There's even more meds. He keeps leaving them behind, though. 1v1. It might not matter. Never mind. The splash is the right play. He needs to just go for the fight. Pre-popping the banana. Smart here. He can go for the Zeus jump. Oh, he gets the Zeus jump. Oh, and the dash. Oh, my movement. Oh, my God. That was so satisfying, but he still might not win. Oh, my God. The movement. No, he's running back in his zone. Get his ass. He's dropped. 
Дай мне Я не попадаю, блядь. Просто не попадаю, нахуй. Oh, he played that really well, man. He played that really well. That's a feels bad. All right, I've seen so I've seen people in better positions. I stare. Oh, I don't even get this full make it off. I don't think. He's still going. He's still going. There's still a chance. Nice. Honestly, he's holding on well here. He's clinging to life. Oh, I don't know about this. He did this earlier. He staggered to play make hits earlier and it cost him the game as well. It's easy to get a refresh when you stagger, but then sometimes the refresh just doesn't even matter because you still die and he's dead. He did his best, man. He did his best. It's a tough one. Nice, Baffo. Let's go. Very nice. There's some med kits. Nice. Yeah, I don't think we even got a single 30 bomb today on EU, did we? I don't think we even got a single 30 bomb today. It's been a rough one. And he's going to have to uh, pick up the slack today. See if Peterball can go for 50. All right, top 26. Nice. Our highest kill game today was 21. Wow. Damn. Looking like last season EU before Marius came along and proved that it can be done. Actually, even then, we had a few 30 bombs. We had Flixies dropped a 30 bomb. Vico's dropped a 30 bomb. We did have 30 bombs. It was 25 from Cade. Okay. Well, that's one way to lose hundred dollars. Twelve alive, twelve elims. Chap looking good. Close it out. Come on, three make it, three splashes. Let's go. Is he gonna go for height? He's got the match to go for a height play here to try and secure the win if he wants to start elevating. He's got the low grab for it too, and the dashes. We could see a high ground play here from Chap. He's looking for it. There it is. Oh. Yep, here we go. There we go. Oh, oh, risky way to take yeah, it. Yeah, that was, that was a very risky way to take it. Oh, this player on high ground looks very shambles. Sitting backside on a w single wood layer. Yeah, very shambles. Man, we've got to just make a solid play for this. I think Chap's just got to build for it. He's trying to like do damage to condition high ground, which I respect. But with like a thousand mads, dash, and low grab, we just got to outbuild them. We have the material. Let's just crank for it. <clears throat> we don't have to hit them this hard. We can just ramp them off. There we go. Nice. Very nice. Some DC ramps for good measure. Very good. Hear kind of sounds? Oh, we have zero audio on the guns. The sounds embarked. Oh, dash to save the full damage. Very nice. The player's coming back up for it. Oh, there it is. I think we've won now. I think we've won. Oh, I cursed him. Okay, now I think we've won. Oh my god, please go play. Okay, now we've won. I don't see how we can lose this now. This is definitely a toss if we lose this. Took down the other healthy player coming for high ground. 200 builds left to close out the heal off. With old builds to get to. Oh, three make kids, five splashes though. Maybe, actually. Maybe. Okay. Grimia. Nine! That's the oldest song get coming! Hey! Oh, that could happen. There's always that. I've said a few times, man. Even if it was like monet, like val, like you know, money aside, and the fact that I love content, like even if I didn't have my dream job in content, I still wouldn't want to work for Epic, only because it looks really rough that you become the face of like the game in the sense that like if something goes wrong now, people instantly blame Hogman or like attack people. But also, I feel like when you work for any billion dollar company, I've done it before. It's very hard to actually you know implement considerable mm. change which can become quite frustrating like a lot of you guys are like you should work at epic you have such good ideas firstly some of my ideas turned out to be fucking terrible and i'll be the first to admit that some things that i thought were going to be awful for the game like sprinting mantling armored walls i was very wrong on but secondly 
actually having the ability to like make change in a billion dollar company can be quite difficult at times and that would frustrate me massively like if i truly at like my core thought that something was better for the game and i pitched it and like devs above me disagree and it didn't change and it just kept getting worse that would trigger me to no end i couldn't handle that i've worked for myself for way too long to have to deal with that level of like bureaucracy 450 wood 120 brick come a long way from sting rest of G's and such true very true i will give you guys full props chapter four has been was excellent and chapter four is uh, chapter five is off to a great start Ooh, we've got to work on that format for fncs though hogman going from half a million players down to 2000 and then 2000 to 1000 is just insane to me we got to work on that that is bad You got like one of the hardest rounds in Fortnite history and then one of the most pointless rounds in Fortnite history, like back to back. If it was like Maybe opens to like top 5,000, then 5,000 to 1,000, that would be like way better or even like 10,000. I feel like it would encourage people to grind more from casual perspective too because like what, top 2,000 is very, very hardly achievable for like most players. My game, put on avec it's like spacing out those first rounds would be amazing. It's nice, I think. Why, though? Like, why do you, like... Why? The whole lobby down to 2,000 is, like, extremely difficult. And, like, the reason you'd have it be so difficult is to, like, taper off quickly. But then we waste a whole round doing 2,000 and 1,000. You go from, like, qualifying less than 0.1% of players to then qualifying 50% of them in the next round. It's just weird, statistically. Do you have a post about the feedback? I do not, Hogman, but I'll happily write one, bro. I'll send you a... I'll, resp I'll respond when I end stream today, bro, with a DM on just, like, my thoughts on it. Right one? All right, sweet. I'm down, dude. See if it does anything, but yeah. I'm down. Because I do think this one also... Like, I think this format... Because most of the takes that you guys probably get are just wanting to cater more to pros. I think this format's actually, like, really rough for casuals. All right, let's see it. Top 22, five elims. Clement has gotten so close. So close to winning today. I kind of want to see him win because I feel like he deserves it. He's played really well. I think he's played all three games out to get top 10s, if I remember. Or well, at least the other two were top 10s, so. Ooh. Top 16. Looking good. Gonna have to make the leap of faith off high ground, though. It's always risky to not get shot on the way down. And ooh, that's extra make kids. We could drop our SMG for that. Ooh, okay. We were, we get a full Fizzberry jar instead. Interesting. Ooh. Nice. Nice. He's playing this well. I think this player above him is just bluffing. I don't think this player above him has good mats. I just, I have a feeling. I have a feeling this guy above him shambles. Oh, he's still fighting for it though. If he shambles, he's committing to it. My man's willing to die for this high ground, which is the scariest kind of player to have to fight on high grounds. And now he's lands on him. I was right. He's got very little mats left. Wait, he just built with brick again. Where did this guy's builds come from? Good chops from Clement though. He's playing this really well against this guy. Dude, he's still got bills. Okay, I could not have been more wrong about this player's material. Apparently, he he found a llama before taking high ground. Oh, Clement's in a rough spot now, though. Now he's lost the high ground. He's invested a lot into this. Now he's stuck on a tree. No. Top six. Bro, he's played this so well. For getting absolutely psychoed on height, he's played this so extremely well. God, I want to see him win this, but I don't think he will. Nice. pre pop the banana. Take a bit of storm. Okay. There's only six players alive, so we might be able to win this heal off by playing it early, but I don't know. At the same time, though, if he ran out there, he was almost definitely dead without Siphon. Nice. There we go. Bit of a top up. Well, he has Siphon. I didn't realize he had the medallion. I should have known with the SMG. 
All right, we're still trying to play the heal off here. We gained a bit of health there from that Siphon, but I don't know. We have to hope it's enough. Clement's going to have a rough day today if he doesn't win this. This is three top tens for no win. Well, they're fighting. 1v1. If that guy didn't have fat meds, he wins. He's moving, which means he probably wins. He wins. He wins. He wins. Oh, la, la. He wins. W. Nice, Clement. He wins.